Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general of reading for my friends Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out together what's coming through for you. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Lovarina. Let's see what we can get for you guys. All right. The dragonfly, be light-hearted, finding out things coming to light, adapt, change, heal. Not today, not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, a call or a person, boundaries, still angry. Bottom of the deck, we have both, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, closure, issues let's also pull some cards from this oracle deck take charge and action and bottom of the deck ease and grace well Taking charge and action with ease and grace is quite something, quite a talent. Let's see what the Tarot has to say about these energies. And we are ready. So, your energies, guys, Three of Swords, Justice, Major Arcana, and the Tower. Your person's energy is the Moon, Ten of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, Meeting Energies, Four of Wands, Five of Pentacles, what a contrast, Ten of Pentacles, Focus, nine of swords and the nine of cups bottom of the deck well this is indeed a contrast of energies so for some of you this can be a well established connection that can even be a marriage or an engagement for others of you the engagement type of scenario can be the core of the issue kinda not being able to move towards that type of scenario that can be a wish granted but if we are not able to uh, manifest it it's a disappointment. The catalyst for a change because a right and fair decision is presented, brought to the table. This person feels that something is not how it should be and the Ten of Wands can be a completion also. This can be the type of interaction, guys, that comes too late, and some of you may, may truly channel the Not Today Oracle card, not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call or a person, still angry, makes sense, Five of Pentacles, this person, left out in the cold, anxiety, uh, about the whole situation, so this can be an energy that speaks to the two of you, maybe in slightly different fashions, but Page of Swords, another energy small when it comes to an interaction, Yes, the Knight of Pentacles can be the energy that can be extremely auspicious even when it comes to build for the future. 
but something stopped working within the connection and and the moon can be about secrets also so guys let's find out a little bit more because the four of ones can be a soulful partnership the ten of pentacles can be a family picture uh, the point is that if within a scenario that should be extremely high on a vibration level ten of pentacles for ones if the five of pentacles creeps in it's kind of like a, a mechanism that stops working because we we bring something within it, you know? We put something within it. So, Three of Swords for some of you. Ace of Pentacles. Wanted to come out. Word. Well. Allow me to say, guys, for those of you that are not married. So, the goal can be the Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands, when it comes to commitment, the Ace of Pentacles is the offer that never came. That's why the word. And these two energies are related to the Three of Swords. For those of you uh, committed or married, the Ace of Pentacles was the starting point from the Ace to the Ten, but the Three of Swords came to play and the word is about a completion so these are two scenarios that can be can be quite challenging to be honest let's see the justice that can be a fair and fair exchange uh, there is truth there is clarity because there is the ace of swords involved it can be about legal matters for those that uh, that are involved in a marriage six of wands the warrior coming back from the battle victorious so victory and justice can come in favor of some of you guys let's also take a look at the tower unexpected uh, change of, of the events unexpected uh, change of the landscape of a situation Ten of Swords, closing of a cycle, huge disappointment, closure issues, moving on. Ten of Swords, challenging energy, guys, um, still valid the point for me that once everything has been said and done, a new dawn is on the horizon and the sun will rise up again meaning that new opportunities will come in favor of those that were called to be brave and power through a challenging situation uh, this is a transition that is due to the fact that it was not possible to fulfill wishes within a connection so if you are married the marriage for some reason didn't work and if you wanted to be married it was not possible to do that with this person let's see for them let's see the moon the moon can be a tricky energy two of pentacles stuck rough waters behind the man there is a cycle this person may be for example unable to dive deeper into the understanding that is about them the moon can be an energy that encourages us to dive deeper into an introspection, shadow work. But if we do not find a way, we are stuck, we refuse to uh, pay attention to factors that can be uh, decisive and we may pay the price for it at some point. Let's see the Ten of Wands.
two of cups closing of a love cycle a love partnership but this is about sharing for me the two of cups is about the chance to grow together with a special person but um, we need to transform this energy into actions otherwise it's a uh, good in potential but it's not manifested let's see the knight of pentacles this can be truly a token that comes too late the fool the knight is asking for uh, a leap of faith a new stage within uh, the connection let's see the meeting at this point guys let's go for the three energies let's start well let's follow the order four of ones death card revolution so if you were married the connection transformed itself not in a pleasant way and this is the core of the issue basically there is no fulfillment and that's why the crumbling down of the tower if you were looking for the opportunity to get married it was not possible the situation is going to change but the death card can also be an energy that starts from within death and rebirth process things coming to light in some sense because it can be a shift in perspective in favor of a person let's see the five of pentacles three of wands expectations intentions this is an energy that is extremely spiritual and the man is waiting for the sun to come up it's kind of like um, expectations were not met within the connection and the five of pentacles the five of pentacles came to the table not what we were expecting not what we were hoping for let's see the ten of pentacles guys five of cups regrets disappointments sadness not dealing hurt truly avoiding a conversation or a person justice one more time allow me to say it's a right and fair decision bottom of it we have the judgment this person can ask for a second chance going with the judgment uh, meaning when it comes to second chances but it seems guys that some of you will bring justice to this situation when it comes to a right and fair decision and there is a completion there is a completion uh, in this uh, flow of energies it was not possible to fulfill wishes within a connection for those that were married it didn't work and for those that were trying to get married the other person was stuck it was not possible So guys, some more oracle cards for guidance considering these energies. Ask your angels. Well, an energy that is about intuition after all. If you believe. This can be about the fact that when we are in a partnership, we, we believe that things can go uh, in a positive way. But it's a two-way street and for whatever reason in this situation it was not possible to to manifest wishes helpful people can be an energy about trusted persons around you or about the fact that there was no reciprocity you know uh, coming from this person if they couldn't find a way to be productive with some of you guys um, it was not possible to help each other out and 
this pattern may have worked against the connection and it's up to you goes with the fact that the justice energy is on your side and also the word it seems that the decision can be yours basically if this person asks for a second chance and a new leap of faith uh, the energies are not exactly in favor of it and this can be a missed chance allow me to say so not today guys I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow some way let us know if you resonate comment like share subscribe to the channel until next time I wish you the best take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon bye